Tinubu Oshibado groups clashes ahead of 2023 presidential election. They support group loyal to Vice President Yemi Oshibado and those backing the whole Progressive Congress national leader Ashiwaju Bola Hamed Tinubu engaged in a war of words on social media, television station and radio following Oshibado's formal declaration of his presidential ambition to run for president come 2023 general election. The action took place after months of speculation as Vice President Yemi Oshibaju released a pre-recorded video on social media on Monday where he informed Nigerians of his desire to succeed the President Major General Muhammad Buhari retired. In this period of seven years, I have served the government in several capacities and I have, at the direction of Mr. President, represented our country in sensitive, high-level international engagements. I've been to practically all local governments in Nigeria. I've been in markets, in factories, in schools, and farms. I've been in agricultural, mining, and oil-producing communities, in the Delta, in Kebi, in Enugu, in Bon, in rivers, in Plateau, and Undo, and in all other states of the Federation, listening to the diverse experiences and yearnings of our people. I've visited our gallant troops in the Northeast and our brothers and sisters in the IDP camps. I've felt the pain and anguish of victims in violent conflicts, terrorist attacks, flooding, fire, and other disasters. I've been in the homes of many ordinary Nigerians in various parts of the country. I have sat with our techpreneurs in Lagos, Edo, and Kaduna, with our Nollywood and Kaniwood actors, with our musicians from Lagos, Onisha, and Kano, and I've spoken to small and large businesses. The declaration was a sequel to a meeting with the APC governors at the presidential villa late on Sunday to seek their support ahead of the party's primary, which is expected to take place next month. The Vice President Yemi Oshibajo, who is aspiring to be the next president of Nigeria, Oshibajo promised to complete the unfinished business of President Muhammad Buhari's regime, including the quest of radically transforming the nation's security and intelligence architecture while completing the reform of the justice system focusing on adequate remuneration and welfare of judicial personnel by ensuring justice for all and the observation of the rule of law, rapidly advancing infrastructural development, especially power, road, railway, and broadband connectivity. He called all Nigerians to support his quest, promising to build a country where everyone is given equal access to the abundant opportunities that God has bestowed on the nation.